life is really all about. Hey YouTube, GC here. Welcome to the Supplement Showdown. Today we've got the Domitized Elite Primal going head to head with their Forever Fit Isolate Natural. All right, on to the positives. 27 grams of protein. Seriously, that's pretty good. And a 33 gram scoop, that is a really high percentage protein. Uh, natural creatine sources. Apparently this protein has three grams of creatine per scoop. That's pretty good. Uh, not a lot of other companies are making proteins with that much creatine per scoop. Now that brings you to the negatives. Okay, this stuff is bad tasting. It is terrible. I honestly rank this probably a one or a two out of five for taste. I did not like it. It tasted like a rank fruit punch, really stale tasting, had a meaty flavor to it. I just didn't like it. Uh, other negatives, Ace K, this thing has acesulfame potassium, you can taste it. It's disgusting. Sucralose, it's got that blended in there too, kind of sick. The most negative hit I can think of this thing is they've created a niche for beef protein. Uh, nobody asked for beef protein. I don't know where the desire came to build a beef protein. There is no shortage of beef in the United States or Canada. Pretty, pretty strange that they came out with this type of protein. That leads me to another type of protein which uh, I've really grown accustomed to. Here it is, the 100% natural fruit blast isolate. This stuff is actually whey protein isolate. Also a fruit flavored protein, a perfect head-to-head -head matchup against the Dimetize Elite Primal. First things first, this stuff is 100% natural. That means no artificial colors or no artificial flavors. This mango flavored tropical 100% natural isolate is not artificial. And it has no real sugar in here. Um, it's all natural, no artificial colors, no artificial sweeteners no artificial flavors it's flavored with mango powder but onto the negatives this is not the coolest marketing i can't give it to them sorry they got this 80s grid going on some mangoes at the bottom it's passable but it doesn't strike me as being very cool so i mean it, a lot of guys just aren't gonna buy it based on it, it just doesn't look awesome sorry but you know once you try it you'll know that it's actually a very, very high quality product. And if that's all that really matters, not how fancy the label is. I mean, obviously the Diamondize Elite Primal has a much more awesome label, but still, doesn't matter to me. Uh, another negative is the sugar alcohol. There is still three grams of xylitol in this. They can still call it natural with xylitol. Not that big of a deal. It technically is still natural according to the labeling, but you know I'd prefer it out of my products. The other small hit is there's only 21 grams of protein. That's a little on the low side for an ice light, but I would just heap the scoop, add a little bit more. It's totally worth it. To summarize, I would go with the 100% natural fruit blast ice light. It hands down beats the Dimatize Elite Primal. I give it an 8 out of 10. It tastes amazing. Uh, it doesn't have any artificial sweeteners. It has reasonably high protein, very good quality, pretty good value, and the Diamondized Elite tastes bloody awful. I wouldn't recommend it to anybody. Uh, despite the amount of creatine, the 3 grams of creatine per scoop, despite it being a very high protein beef, protein I just do not recommend that stuff it's you can't keep it down you can't drink a protein it if it's gonna make you cringe every time you drink it you're just not gonna drink it it's gonna sit in the cupboard gather dust expire on you so there you have it try the 100% fruit blast isolate I highly recommend this stuff it tastes awesome all right guys thanks for watching my channel take a look at the rest of my videos train hard keep it real peace so I'm turning it up